What is going on guys? Welcome back to the another Android application development tutorial in Android Studio. In this video, we are going to learn how to design buttons in XML in Android. So we need buttons to make user interface. So in this video, we are going to learn how to make design of different size of buttons, color of buttons or how can we create more than one buttons in a single application. So let's start with a new Android Studio project. Click on new Android Studio project give the application name anything you can't i am giving right now buttons demo company domain your domain name if you have any domain name otherwise anything you can give project location give your project location in your drive and package name it automatically generates the package name with your domain name and the application name you can change it also if not click next select the minimum sdk version and i am selecting android version 4.0 so that above version will support this application so next select the activity there are different type of activity but right now we are selecting empty activity we want to design some buttons in empty activity so click next here comes activity name and layout name it is automatically generated uh, you can change it also otherwise click finish it will load our project in android studio It will take some time to load. So we will design different types of buttons, how we create button in Android Studio and we will give the size of the buttons so that uh, there is two main thing. There are two main things in uh, developing. Uh, there is Java part where we can code and there is XML part where we can design the application. So here this comes the coding part and this is the designing part. Right now we are only designing so we can cancel this uh, Java part. So here are the two tabs, design tab and text tab. In design tab, there are different types of controls, text view, buttons, image view. We can drag and drop it also here. But we are not drag and drop right now. We will uh, write the actual code, XML code to create the buttons. So click here in the right side, there is preview button. Click there, it will preview our application. First of all, so uh, we will adjust this. Okay, so change this constant layout to linear layout right now because it is easy to understand and easy to design. So for now, change this layout to linear layout. Uh, so it will, there is hello world text view. We will delete this right now. So we have an empty activity with only application name and nothing in the application so to create button there is a control or there is a tag button capital B button so when we click enter it will ask for width and height we can give any width and any height here is an two option of width and height that is wrap content and match parent first give wrap content it means it will wrap the content what is the content inside button if it is ok button just ok it will be small if it is button like press here to go to another bed it will increase the width of the button according to the text inside the button it will increase the size so height also wrap content let's check uh, like giving text we have text property android text like ok so it is a small button automatically it will increase if we have long text go to another page so button size is automatically increasing because we have wrap content given the width as wrap content so it will content wrap the content so right now we will only uh, give press ok so there are four main things in button we have to input compulsorily four main properties that are width height text and id id is something unique we have to give unique id to each button because if you want to uh, click button or we, if you want to do something on click of the button there are different buttons so we have to give unique id to each of the button to code in java so android id and at the rate plus id we have to enter and uh, i can give id any id name for now button one so this is the id text height and width we need these four things compulsorily to create a button in XML 
so like this we can create more than one button by just copy it and paste it so there are two button it will uh, we can change the text of second button confirm and we can there is error in id because it is repeated we have to give unique id so i will give button 2 so the buttons are displaying horizontally one after another so we can change if you want vertically it can be displayed vertically go to linear layout property and there is orientation property change it to vertical so it will vertically display all the buttons if you want uh, horizontally we can type horizontal right now i want to add vertically so there are two buttons with same size wrap content wrap content so it will have size with the content if you want to change if you want this confirm button to occupy whole screen whole the width so we can give here match parent it will occupy the whole width like this whatever the width of your application is it will occupy the whole width with here also if you give match parent height it will occupy the whole screen so for height we will give wrap content and for width we will give match parent in this way different size can be created another button we can create as different size we can copy this and paste it oh, sorry we can copy this and paste it here third button is created so this uh, uh, you can also give uh, like uh, this is a square button okay you can also give the width as number no need to give match parent and wrap content you can also give as dp size like i can give 100 dp it will create 100 dp of width i can give 150 dp if i give 150 dp to height also so it will make the size of button a square because width and height are same so it will create different size of button in this way you can create any any number of button and with any different size like this i give i will give long width and small height so this button is another button go to like this give the id unique id button 4 so in this way you can create different size of buttons with giving the um, wrap content or match parent or any number of sizes so if you want to change the color or if you want to increase the text uh, uh, right now i want to increase the text of this uh, square should be appear larger so go to this button property where this button is available so go to this property and text size there is property android text size change this text size to any size you want like 25 dp 30 dp so the text can be increased so i want to change the color of this button if you want to change color of any particular button go to that button tag and change background android background there is property android background you can change the color there are list of available color color primary dark or color primary you can give your hash code also like uh, to see so in this way you can change the color you can search hash code in uh, website or google so this in this way you can change the color nine so in this way you can have different color of buttons and different size of buttons uh, you can change the color of text also like square you i want a green so i will go to text color primary dark is green so this is the way to create buttons and to change the size and color of the buttons so we'll run this project whether it is working or not it is displaying correctly or not so we are we have not added anything in java part so when we press these buttons nothing will be happen because we have only added we only displayed the buttons we have not written actual code in java part we will write those code in upcoming videos right now only for designing i am showing the tutorial so how we can design the buttons with different shape and sizes and colors also so it will take some time to load uh, in emulator you can create as many number of buttons 
it is launching our activity on emulator let's see it is displayed correctly or not yes so this is button you know, we have uh, wrap content so it is content wrap and this is match parent so all width is taken it is square because 150 150 dp we have taken and this is 200 dp and 120 dp so in this way buttons will work button will not work right now when we click but in this way button are displayed and designed so we will uh, make this implementing on click uh, on upcoming uh, videos right now that is the only thing we are can do we can add more buttons also so if you have any queries and uh, questions about designing the buttons please comment down below i will reply and uh, see you in the next video bye bye